Hello, Sid friends, and we have another LP house out in the market, and it is called the Elegant Escape Estate, and it is on sale for five hundred um, and ninety nine LP. So let's see if this house is actually worth the LP, or or if it's just another shit show. So let's get started. So here is the original house. On the outside, um, it looks okay. I really don't like the windows, how they're all mixed up. Um, it just seems a little bit off. Um, but the structure itself, um, it looks nice. And in the backyard, it's a small backyard. And there's a hedge that's blocking the back door. I don't know why that is, but we will find out, I guess. Um, and then, and there's these two plants here, and, and then over here we have some more plants. There's a lot of plants outside this house. This place threw up plants. And there's... On the inside, I like the doorway. Outside, I like the doorway. On the inside, I do not. That's not my cup of tea. And then here's the kitchen. It just seems like things were placed here. Um, as for the inventory, there's there's really not anything new. Some people may not have this couch. I didn't, um, I didn't, do I think that that was from the lodge event? The, the Christmas lodge. Um, and then that rug underneath the couch. Um, a few people may not have that. And... And then we have that white staircase. Um, it's a chalet staircase. And these black and white floors are just... No. They're just... No. They, they look horrible for what they're doing. Um, the laundry room, the laundry room, you have to go outside for. I'm not a big fan of that. To me, that makes no sense. Um, although it has a doorway right there. And then you come upstairs. And there is... This is where it doesn't make sense. This makes no sense at all. There's one bedroom, there's a study, there's a closet, a huge ass one, and then there's two bathrooms, which which doesn't make sense to me. Um, there is no other, you know, there's, you know, there's no other bedroom up here and I'm going to change that I'm in the remodel um I have an idea to turn it into a four bedroom house this is just horrible this layout is is horrible it makes no sense at all there's a lot of small places. Um, 
and just how they have it. I don't really like it. Um, not really anything new in terms of inventory. You have the glam mansion items, the chic event items. You have the Moroccan rug. So if you like the house, but you don't want to spend the LP, here is the grid. So, so my final thoughts for this house is that I don't think it's worth it. I think that it's a waste of LP, especially if you have all of these items. Even if you're a newer player, there have been other LP houses that have more in that have more um, inventory than this one. This one just isn't exciting. Um, the structure is all right. Um, the layout sucks. And so here is the remodel. Um, I made it green to match the plants, and um, it's an eye thing that it turned out cute. It's um, um, I think it looks like a very homey house, you know, on the outside. Um, I kept, you know, like I kept to the backyard the same, but I just moved the hedge. But I didn't put in a back door or anything because I forgot. So, and so here is the front entrance. I kept it the same because I, uh, because I liked how it looked. So, as we go into the house, um... You come to a fireplace, and then you get that new fruit clock, and also the uh, the new calendar we got from Simchins. And then, and then I put in that rug. Like, um, I like that rug. I think it's really cute. But I forgot what event it's from. And then in this hallway, you know, I made this a hallway, and and I put in that table with the lamp and a plant. And then over here is the staircase, um, and it has that artwork up on the wall. There's a lot of doorways here. Um, and I wanted the, the floors to be lighter, like a light wood. So I chose uh, the nautical oak, I think it's called. I could be wrong. Um, you know, but here is the living room and it has a fireplace a lamp and a plant and then also those two chairs in that rug i love that rug and then here is a hallway that comes to you know to the dining room and also to a bedroom so here is a kid's bed um, a kid's bedroom And then, then there's the dining room. I put in that table. I for, um, I I forget what it's called. I I think it's a wedding table. If I remember correctly. And then I put in those rugs because I thought it looked cute with the home. When I 
added, you know, like a little bit of color. And also that picture on the wall. And then, and then here's the kitchen. Um, the, uh, the cabinets. I, I forget where they're from. And I forget where the sink is from. But the fruit tray on the sink is from these sim trays. And then here upstairs, um, you come into this room. And I just put some shelves here. Um, and a computer desk. Um, and then it has a door that leads into that, leads into that bedroom with that, with that cherry, um, gaudy bed. That's new. Um, and I put it on computer there. Each room I try to add a computer. And and then in order to get to the other rooms, you have to go through the bathroom, which is quite stupid, but that's how this house was laid out. It was really dumb. But, um, but there's a bedroom right there with that wizardy bed. And then here's one with, with the king size bed. And, and then also in here is the, is, where's the four post, um, that's a king size bed. Then I have put a flower outside. So that is Riz Remodel.